As I'm sure you're all aware, uh, there's a terrible war going on in Europe. Russia have aggressively attacked the sovereign nation of Ukraine. And I'm not going to talk too much politics in, in this video, but I am personally very affected by this. Some of my best friends are from Ukraine, I'm having close relations there, and yeah, it just makes me very sad. I'm sure that a lot of you have uh, supported and helped Ukraine. Maybe you gave money to some charity, maybe you're helping local refugees or doing whatever you can. Uh, but I found a different way to, uh, to support uh, the Ukrainian people, and especially the Ukrainian business that is related to what we do, part of it. I have uh, for many years um, worked with, uh, with uh, some, some Marcus Marx. You know these little stamps that you can stamp your pottery with, and I had a local uh, producer make these ones in uh, wood, and uh, they're nice. But uh, the problem with the wooden ones, I think they're cut in CMC or something. I don't know much about how he makes that. But anyway, the problem with the ones in wood is that, first of all, they don't last forever. That's just how it is. Um, and also, he can't make them so high, so the imprint is not so deep. And also. It's difficult to make very thin lines because they kind of break off in the wood. So I was looking for something stronger and then by accident I found this uh, lady in uh, Ukraine, Alina, uh, that makes these wonderful uh, stamps in, um, in stainless steel. And I think she laser cuts them or something. And they are like, they're like super nice. Um, heavy duty ones and they are much deeper, so the imprint is deeper, and the fine lines can be very, very fine, they're very, very sharp, and, and I'm sure these ones are going to last my lifetime. They, 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 they're very solid. Um, and the good news is, they didn't actually cost more than the ones I have made in wood locally. I think I paid about $100 for these ones, including shipping. Uh, I'm not sure if there's free shipping all over the globe, but at least from Ukraine to Denmark, she had that. Um, I think that's cheap, and and I think it's a, it's it's a great contribution, and I think it's a it's a great way to help Ukrainians instead of just sending money, which which is also good, by the way, and helping refugees. I do that myself, but this is a good way because hopefully, sometime soon, this war is going to be over, and they need their business, and and this is I think a good way to 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 help them with that. And if we look at the uh, the way that they they, they, they they print, you can see here. Um, first, I'll print. Uh, oh, I'll mark with the, 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 the top row is uh, the new ones from Alina, uh, the stainless steel. And as you see, they go quite deep. And uh, then I'll try two of the wooden ones I have. And as you can see, they're not as sharp. And there's some small artifacts from from the wood, and they're a little more blurry. So I mean, they're just generally. Very, very sharp and this is a uh, stoneware by the way it's not super smooth if you if you use them on porcelain they will be even sharper so I think the quality here is, is speaks for itself it's, it's really really good anyway I um, put a link in the description to Alina's Etsy store where you can go and order them the different prices depending on, on how width how big they are please go ahead and order the more business we can send there the better Thank you very much.